Hello and welcome back to Star Wars The Old Republic. Here we are. I'm going to fight Zogan Sir again. Last time we defeated him first try. I drink to that thought. And you, Corso. And you. No, no. I take this skill stem to you. And, and then, ah. Oh. Oh, let me just look at my all the successes. Hopefully, hopefully, Sogan says watching as I I taunt him with my my medals, my tokens of appreciation, all my proof that I have owned these bounties before, and now I've got a new owning implement. A scrambling field, rather. It's something to prevent being owned. Ready to get owned, Corso? Have a godless? Yes, you're going to be. All right. So, if memory serves, the thing to do is to stay away from the razors, razor guys, and to uh, and to all go up this ramp, and to stay away from the flame guy, cause he flames. All right. That's the plan. Run away! It always works well. <laughs> That's interesting. So let's do this. All right. Uh, rendezvous beacon. Act sabotaging. Oh, I always think it's activating. Sabotaging. All right. Here we go. Where is he? Show yourself. Oh! Hello! Dead, she kicked and blast a whip. Alright. I didn't. I didn't do what I said I was going to do. It, it means that Corso's almost dead. That's bad. I feel, I feel like the result of this is that. I, I'm, I'm going to have to, uh. Oh! Okay, I'm going to kneecap you! Kneecapping! Ah! Ow! Alright, so I had to pull out of there because that things were getting very bad. That was ugly, what we just saw. That was very ugly. Had to get out of that. Alright, and that's the other good thing about yes. running away, is that, that he won't, he will only follow so far. Wait, where's my, where's my, ah, I have to go up there now, because I put this here. I ran out of spots. If I was, now if I was a preferred player, I'd have more spots, but I'm not, and I'm not gonna be for a while. So... <clears throat> Deal with it, electronic arts. I'm making do with what little money I have. None. Budget of nothing. E except the Mac Pro. I'm buying that. Bought that. All right. This time I'm Scramble Field. Ah. So that's how it works. I let this guy... So if I sit in this, then I'll be fine. Is that right? Or at least 20% more fine. Corso, get in that thing. Uh, not even I'm in that thing. And now the thing is gone. Yep, that's what happens. Ah! All right, Razor Ghoul. Die. Other oh, Razor Ghoul. Die. So good, sir. Die. Ah. Alright. Listen. Here's what we're doing. Now I'm going to aim this shot. And. Ow! How do you fling fire so far? Ah! Okay. Here. Take this. Take this. I don't know about this. Oh dear! Okay. Please stop killing me. There. I, I'm dodging. 
I take this. Yes. Yes. All right. Just unloading my billet. All right. Stop it, please. All right. All right. See? I'm able to go far away. All right. Stop following me. You're not. Okay. Here's how we're going to play this. I'm going to keep running away. And you're either going to follow or you're going to not follow. Eventually. Ah! No! 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 Let me roll under cover and then get out of here. Let me. Let me hide. I'm hiding. I'm attempting to hide. Okay, that was bad. But we survived. If these guys kill me, that's going to be embarrassing. Guys, I've got like less than 1%. I've got very little health. Doesn't matter. You're all dead. Okay. <clears throat> we'll try this again. Um, this time, hopefully, we can stay within our boundary. A little nice. scrambler field. Of course, uh, try, try and stay within your scrambler field. You will scramble your bolts. I, I guess it's what it is, is on the outside, it's got that, that green stuff. And stuff that passes from the inside to the outside is fine. Stuff that passes from the outside to the inside is not fine. Think, think Star Wars 1. The Phantom Menace. Think the stuff that the dro battle droids use against the Nabooans. Think that. Wait. It was the other way around. Right. Anyway. That uh, is what we're using here. Scrambler Field. Same, same principle. Alright. Ready to die principally, Corso. Here we go. Rendezvous beacon, sabotaging. All right. Sogan, sir, show yourself. Well, dude, why do you keep coming in from that angle? The best you got. <laughs> I got All right. I, I really probably should be farther away from him because he does stuff like that. Come and get me. I'm ready. All right. Your flamethrowing Corso. That's fine. He's got this flame retardant flame guard. Which I'm guessing doesn't actually help him. Much. Alright. I should be attacking these razor ghouls. Because the razor ghouls are powerful. Ah! ah I'm out of here. I'm out. I'm out of here. Hopefully I can make it. All right, kneecap. Ah, die. Okay. Combat averted. All right, eventually we're gonna actually have to fight the guy. But right, Jill Dan running's fine. We'll just do that. It'll be. You know what? It almost seems like it's it's harder whenever I level up. It almost feels like they're more difficult every time I level up and I have to get even more skilled with the abilities I have to choose from. You know, it's it, what I have, I just... I, it's so... Eventually, it would be impossible for me to win no matter what I do. Still got some fight in Hopefully that we haven't reached that point. Anyway, that's going to wrap this episode up because time, we've run out of time. Thanks for watching. Goodbye.